Hello, my name is Caitlin with West Palm Dog, and today I'm here with Caleb, and we're going to be working on his loose leash walking and his leave it. Now, what we're going to be doing today is walking around the patio where I've scattered a couple treats around, and I do have some treats in my hand, and the goal here is that whether I'm tossing the food on the ground or it's already there, I want Caleb to leave it alone. Caleb, let's go. Uh-uh. So he's a little bit distracted by the food in my hand. There we go, much better. Leave it. Yes. I'm gonna go ahead and treat him every time he gives me eye contact. Come on. Yes. Now, as you can see, I'm just sporadically dropping that food. Now, if Caleb tries to go for any of the food, I'm going to say, leave it. Leave it, uh-uh. Let's go. Let's go. Now there you see he was really, really fast, but I just went ahead, corrected him, and repeated leave it. Leave it's one of the few commands we can repeat when necessary. It's really important that we're keeping an eye on Caleb because we want to follow through with all of our commands. We don't just want to let him have the treat just because he's pulling us. Leave it. Yes! That time was much better. I'm going to treat him for that one. Come on. We're gonna do one more lap. Good job. Leave it. Yes. Now to stop, I'm just gonna get his attention, take a couple extra steps. Caleb. Very nice stop right there. And that was an excellent job. As you can see, Caleb was definitely struggling with this exercise, especially with that piece right around there. But I just went ahead, corrected him, kept on moving, used the leave it command. And as you can see, after that second round, he didn't even look at it. He was just giving me eye contact. Overall, very nice drop from Caleb. Good job.